what's up all you delightful degens? I'm the Ginger Giant, and welcome to another installment of Safe and Stony, where we're just trying to have a good time and spread some good vibes. So if you like what we're doing here, y'all already know what to do down below. And without further ado, let's get into the video. What we got today is something I'm rather excited for. We picked up the entire Dishonored series, and we're going to go ahead and just start a whole playthrough on it. And we're going to start off with Dishonored, the Definitive Edition. So, let's go ahead and get to it. Let's do normal. It's been a few years since I played. Well, let's, let's get a quick rip in here. We got some more of that apple fritter loaded up, so if you all know what you're smoking on or smoking out of, go ahead and let me know in the comments down below. It's always nice to see what y'all are smoking on all around the globe. But cheers. Now, sorry if I'm being a little quiet. The other residents of the house are asleep, so I'm just trying to be respectful. Corvo, if only there was someone else I trusted to send, so that you could remain near. But there is no one else, and the spy master was right to insist that I send you. The plague has taken so many, and we must find a cure. When you are near, my heart is at peace. Emily and I will count the days until you return. Hurry home, and bring good news. Is there any news to bring, my man? Steady hand! That's it. Watch it! Cast off line! Passing off! We're away! Take us straight to Dunwall Tower. Lord Corvo has news for the Empress, and we've come a long way. A long way to bring bad news. The sailors say there's a curse on us. Black magic. <coughs> Superstition. For all we know, there's a cure for the plague by now. Maybe. We live in strange times. Sending the Empress's bodyguard away for a couple of months. That's unusual. Well, this is important. We need help with the rat foot. The Empress will be waiting for your news, Corvo. It's been good traveling with you, Corvo. You know what to do next time? Welcome back, Lord Protector. Have you ever met my niece, Callista? She's getting more beautiful every year. Her Majesty is waiting in the pavilion. Yes, sir. Hello, sir. The Spy Master is with her, but she'll want to see you right away. Corvo, you're back! Will you tell me about your trip, please? Were there any whales? Wait! Let's play hide and seek first. I'll cover my eyes and you hide. Do you have time? Mother's busy talking to that nasty old Spy Master. Okay, here we go. Let's go! Come on! Welcome home, Lord Protector. Stop moving, Campbell. 
And you, Corvo, welcome back. Wherever you've been. They sent him all around the Isles to beg for aid. Waste of time. My elixir will banish the plague from this city. Now keep still a moment, High Overseer Campbell. Scientists painted Saw my improvements to the waterlock. In this painting, I insult my own genius. <laughs> It was a fool's errand, Corvo. The plague comes from inside us. We must all strengthen our faith. I overseer. I must okay, ask you to you. hold your pose. See if you're so good at this. I'll hide my eyes and count, and at the end of the countdown, I'll try and find you. Okay, I'm going to count to ten. Find a place to hide. Okay, you win. We should go now, so Mother can see you too. Uh... Later, will you give me more climbing lessons? Someday I'm going to climb up to the rooftop. Later, will you show me that TV and chokehold like you promised? I won't tell Mother. She'll see you at once. Things are bad. Could the city get any worse? I'll be happy you're back with the watch. I'm no diplomat. Hello, my lord. They're sick people, not criminals. We've gone beyond that question, your majesty. They're... They're my citizens, and we will save them from the plague if we can. All of them. Very well. We will not speak of this again. Mother, Corvo is back. Thank you, Emily. Leave us, please. As you wish, your majesty. Corvo. Two days early. Full of surprises, as usual. It's a fair wind that brings you home to me. Follow me what news have you brought? We should leave them alone. I hope that one of the other cities had dealt with this before, knew of some cure. This news is very bad. We're at the breaking point. Cowards. They're going to blockade us. They'll wait to see if the plague turns the city into a graveyard. Are you okay, Mother? You seem sad. Yes, don't worry, darling. Mother is fine. Wait, where are the guards? Who sent them away? Mother, look! What are they doing on the rooftop? What? Emily, come here! to attack with right hand L to attack with your left hand if you have a weapon out. R1 to block. Emily, get behind me! Look out! <laughs> Corvo, thank you. If you hadn't been here... No more! Not again! Mommy! No! Get away from her! Corvo! Oh, 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 oh. Corvo! 
It's all coming apart. Find, find Emily. Protect her. You're the only one. You'll know what to do. Won't you? Corvo. I'll try. I'll try. You warned us all. Look at what he's done. Yes, he's killed the Empress. What did you do with young Lady Emily, traitor? Her own bodyguard. Ironic. I'll see you beheaded for this, Corvo. Take him. Chance, Corvo. Sign the confession and let me give you the rights to put your spirit at ease. I don't know that you That's enough for now. Get out. Let's give the man some time to think. Corvo, the Empress is dead. Her daughter Emily is hidden away, and no one will ever know the truth. Yes, unlucky you. Tomorrow you'll be executed, but it's for a good cause. This country needs strong leadership now, someone to guide the weak, and that's where we come in. There was nothing personal in this, even though you almost sank our plans. But it turned out well. You were in the wrong place at the right time, and someone has to take the fall. Goodbye, Corvo. Done! Get back to yourself. Wait, wait. You should eat, Corvo. This meal comes from a friend. Interrogation room. Take the explosive there and plant it on the outer door. When the bomb goes off, run. Make for the river and lose yourself in the sewers. You'll find useful gear stashed there. One of the prison guards will leave a weapon just outside your cell. Good luck. We need you alive and well for what is to come. A friend. Okay. Slack John as Bottle Street Boys jump you. I don't need shit from you. So many people are coming to the execution. There ain't no way I'd steal from the Boyle family. I just worked on their roof. The one who killed the Empress abducted her daughter. Emily. You're out. Good for you. Okay. Cut some throats. Right. Social yes. event high and mighty. Come see the noble Lord Protector get his head chopped off. As bad as us betting on the dog fights. Attention. The solitary wing is off limits to maintenance unless accompanied by an officer of the watch. Escort through the solitary wing must be scheduled in advance with one week's notice. Buy a ration of elixir from today. Bug someone else. What in the What in the
So if you want to read it yourself, yeah, you can, you have time. Solitary wing is off limits to maintenance unless tomorrow. accompanied by an officer yeah, of the law. Yeah, everything has to be sent for. Solitary wing is scheduled in advance with one week's notice. Watch it. Not the only one. 
Another bone rip, anyone? <laughs> yeah, that was kind of weak. I'm not good at that. Hey, right. cheers, yo. kill on his way out of the prison. I guess if you'll kill... We don't care about a few guards. Shut up. Look at this stuff. Somebody's been down here. Bottle Street gang, baby. Watch for booby traps. Could be some down here by the look of it. Good. If we're lucky, one of them will get Corvo. You're afraid of him?
the bodies in the carts headed to the flooded district? Yeah. But screw that. I'm too far. I don't want to catch the play. Yeah. No. Doesn't the elixir prevent it? Maybe. Either way, let's just jump them down there. The rats. Weapon wheel. Hold L1 to open the quick access wheel. Select the gadget or the power you want to equip on the left hand and release L1 to confirm. Thank you. 
Yeah. <laughs> I found a new booty. I found treasure in these islands. <laughs> I don't know how I went to a pirate there, but it did. Don't mind me. You won't get past me, sir. Do you know who we're hunting here? Don't try to take him out alone. What if you <laughs> I'm not evil, it's just a video game. Don't judge me by my actions here. Samuel, and I work for some good people who want very much to meet you. Well, they said you'd come out here. I can still hardly believe it. I'll take you to meet them. Just down the river from here. Okay, 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 okay. So there was nothing to be found cool. other than money, but we're fine. This is the Hound Pits pub, closed for business. Half the district marked off is dead from the plague. We're right under the Lord Regent's nose, and he don't know a thing. Of course, if anyone finds out what we're up to, the watch will break in with swords drawn. And now that you've escaped, the Lord Regent's going to be tearing the city apart. Take you up to meet Admiral Hatlock and the rest of your loyalists. The Admiral's a man to be reckoned with. If anyone can help you find that missing girl, Lady Emily, and clear your name, he can.
though it's starting at last, Admiral. We've found up. We can continue this later, Lord Pendleton. The man of the hour is here. Corvo, I'm Admiral Havelock, a true servant of the Empire, like you. Until the Lord Regent purged those of us who wouldn't recognize his claim on the throne. And I'm Lord Trevor Pendleton. I represent the nobility in our little group. But we all act as equals here at the Hound Pits pub. This is a momentous occasion, Corvo. I'm going to come out with you. We've been building a coalition of loyalists, aimed at ending the Lord Regent's tyranny and restoring the throne. At risk of execution, we're committed to finding young Lady Emily and seeing her crowned as Empress. We've got big plans, but we can't do any of it without you. We need your skills, your ability in a fight, and in helping us, we're going to help you destroy the men who murdered the Empress. Sorry, you must be exhausted. We can discuss this further after you've recovered, but before you retire, you should introduce yourself to Piero. He's challenging at times, but his industrious mind buys him that right. Yes, Piero's as much an artist as a technician. He's going to be crafting the gear you'll need. Go talk to him, and then get some sleep. We can talk more when you've rested. Good to have you with us, Corvo. Nothing against the others, but there's no substitute for a man who's done his service for the crown. <laughs> Have you talked to Piero yet? He made the weapons we left for you on your way out of Colbridge Prison. I will. I haven't anything. even left you sight, boy. Come on. Let me pick up things. I'll be crafting your weapons and gear. All custom work. For you, I will create the tools of a master set. happened now the tank of whale oils run out will you get a new tank from upstairs please while i hold this in place be careful oil unstable when it explodes there is a terrible mess just Perfect. Thank you, Corpus. Here, see? The Assassin's Mask. You're a wanted man, so everyone in the city knows your face. But this mask is really terrible to you. If you just hold still, the fit must be precise. There. Can you see normally? The lens out of alignment. There. Better now? I could create more for you. Upgrades for your gear, weapons, munitions. But our situation here is desperate. Scavenge the city for valuables, and I will resell them on the black market. That should give us the money to craft the things you need. Tell me what I can make for you. Oh, I can pick up a lot of things. Fire walls of light, arc pylons, and watchtowers will harm your enemies instead of you, while rewiring alarms will be fully disabled. Nice. A spring razor trap will attach to enemy to any surface by aiming by aiming at it and pressing M. It will be triggered as enemies approach, throwing up a cloud of shrapnel. Nice. You must be exhausted. I advise that you get some sleep. Your life will get even more difficult soon. You should rest while you can. Very well. You know best. Let me know if you need anything more.
dangerous? Yes, very much so, but no need to fear. He is here to work with our masters. People say he killed the Empress. Of course he didn't. People are foolish and believe whatever they're told. Okay. If the Admiral trusts him, then so will I. The Admiral served in the Navy under the Empress. But something happened with the Lord Regent that drove the Admiral out. If I understand it right. Please follow me to your quarters. Pleased to meet you, Master Corvo. I saw you at court in happier days, but you might not remember. I was once a close ally to the Lord Regent, Hiram Burroughs, back when he was just the spy master. He's one manipulative bastard, I can tell you that. Is that right? My furnishings have been installed at last with no small amount of complaining by that antiquated boatman. The others have no idea what it's like to suffer as I have. Or as he had, the way you are acting like royalty, fuck off. Log entry 1 4. It seems we have moved to a new phase. Martin's improvisations have borne fruit. The former bodyguard has been freed and is en route to a staging location. Pendleton's voting block and my military connections. All we've lacked is the ability to reject lethal force in a controlled manner against a previously inaccessible. The only way to help them is to bring them to the city watch. They will be taken to the flooded district for treatment. My, you must be Corvo. I am Lydia, at your service. Your room is upstairs and ready. When they told me who it was, well, I thought you'd be older, like the Admiral. <laughs> Give me the key. I'm sorry it's so dark. We can't risk being seen. It is a bit romantic, though, isn't it? Be advised, the river crust infestation has spread downriver, as far as the river mouth and flooded district. Do not attempt to approach or destroy a river crust. Any items recovered from doing so are considered state property. Sorry about that, y'all. I don't know what happened, but I just about got sick. Maybe it's got the motion sickness or what, I don't know, but good gracious. This is your room. It was chosen to give you privacy. I understand you'll need your rest. Hello, Corvo. Your life has taken a turn, has it not? The Empress is dead, her precious daughter Emily is lost somewhere in the city, and you will play a pivotal role in the days to come. For this I have chosen you, and drawn you into the void. I am the Outsider, and this is my mark. There are forces in the world and beyond the world, great forces that men call magic, and now these forces will serve your will. 
Use this newfound power. My gift to you. Come find me. that follow, your trials will be great, Corda. Seek the ancient runes bearing my mark in the lonely places of your world, and at shrines raised in my name. These runes will grant you powers beyond those of other men. To help you find these runes, I give you this, the heart of a living thing, molded by my hands. With this heart, you will hear many secrets, and it will guide you toward my runes, no matter how they may be hidden. Listen to the heart now, and find another rune. How you use what I have given you falls upon you, as it has to the others before you. Now I return you to your world, but know that I will be watching with great interest.
like uh, was it just a dream, but it is. <laughs> Bone charms provide small supernatural benefits to locate them by listening listening for the songs they emit. By default, you can activate up to three bone charms at once in the bone charm selection of the journal. Just acquired a lot of coin, I might say. I'll let it go like the Star Wars theme, and if you want to read it, you can. When sword versus sword contest more frequently, shot whiskey bottles explode with greater intensity. Damage from explosions reduced are reduced slightly. White rats won't attack me. Powers. Effect slightly improved. White rats can be consumed for man. Let's do that. Assassinations give a bit of health. Enemies live more often with arrows and bolts. Some Swedes increase. Breath capacity in water is slightly increased. Moderate keyhole beeping magnification. Breaking glass sound is moderately reduced.
heals his health, and the money changes hands. Have luck. What can I do for you? Elementary songs, history of the Isles, geography of the Isles, the seven strictures, litany of the white cliff, sayings of the overseer. One day we'll get a few new books.
Hold on. Let's go back. If I keep doing that, I'm just gonna die. <laughs> Let's get down to it. First off, I know that assassination is dark business, but sometimes good men have to do bad things to make the world right. Our purpose is clear. We want to restore Her Majesty's line by finding and putting Emily Caldwin on the throne. To those ends, we'll hide, act in shadow, take them apart, piece by piece. Tonight, High Overseer Campbell dies by your hand. It won't be easy. He's protected by his overseers, an army of religious zealots. But if anyone can do it, you can. Your exploits are legendary. Campbell carries a private journal. Once you've eliminated him, get the journal, because we think it contains Emily's location. Recovering her is obviously critical, assuming she's alive. That's the gist of it. Remember our cause and strike true. We're counting on you. Another thing. Campbell is holding a former overseer by the name of Martin. He's one of us, and if you manage to find him, give him whatever help you can. He's a master strategist, and he got caught working for our cause. It'd be good to have him back here at the Howe Pits. Glad to see you got your rest, Corvo. You'll need it. No more key on her. Oh, Corvo? If you've a moment. Corvo. Hello. I'm Callista. I work here for Admiral Havelock. I'm sorry to intrude on your business, but this is important. I suspect you're going to kill the High Overseer. That wretched man. There's really no reason for you to listen to me. But my uncle, Jeff Kernow, still serves as captain in the City Watch. But he's a good man, and my only family. The chatter in servant circles is that Campbell just took delivery of an exotic poison. And I think I know why. My uncle's not corruptible like the rest of them. Campbell is going to poison my uncle. Do you think you could protect him? You used to do that, right? Before you had your current profession. Before you became an assassin. Um, well, before we go off on our mission, I think we're gonna go ahead and end off episode one here. So I hope y'all enjoyed, and until next time, you all stay safe and stay stony. Peace. Bloody blow. I used to be an addict chasing the dough. It was the way I'm cold. Ice, powder, pills, K2. I would take whatever do to them. One day there was sitch, a glitch. I had a heart attack, bitch. So I flipped the switch. Haven't touched the stuff since. It's been five years' time, and I still get flashbacks at night. Sometimes it's ice, sometimes it's spice. Either way, I still wake up wide-eyed So I smoke a little bug to try and get my head right So judge me if you will, but at least I keep it real Well, y'all are hiding behind excuses like a shield Ain't it me, need mine anymore I used to be an addict chasing the dog You think it sounds far-fetched, the absurdity Started out as a way to escape The everyday modernity is one steal Slippery slope, one steep slippery slope to misery.